So, I got the first dose of the Pfizer COVID vaccine today, and I'm getting ready to review all of next month's upcoming releases. Could this day get any better? Welcome back to another episode of Overly Honest Movie Reviews. My name is Chris, and as always, I try to give you guys what you want to see. Please like this video, then subscribe and follow me for more content like this. I cover anything and everything related to movies, both old and new. So normally, this is all about the films that I'm looking forward to with next month's release. First, I would like to point out a film that I would suggest against getting. This is personal bias, and I can't express how let down I was by it. Studio Ghibli is known for their beautifully hand-drawn animation, and instead, they released the abomination known as Earwig and the Witch. I won't be ordering this, and if you have any love for the art of great animation, I would suggest not wasting your time or money on it either. Okay, so on to the positives. On April 13th, Spaceballs is getting its release by Kino Lorber on 4K, a brand new 4K scan of the original camera negative, as well as some digital cleanup and graded color. Also, it'll be in Dolby Vision and HDR10. <sighs> now, if I only had a 4K TV with HDR. When April 20th rolls around, I'll finally get my new copy of Fantasia and Fantasia 2000. I literally just bought the last version of this on Blu-ray that had been out of print about a month before the Disney Movie Club announced. So, I sold my copy on eBay and ordered this right away. Normally, I don't do a lot of sponsored type things, and this isn't a sponsored thing. But, I will have my links to the Disney Movie Club in the description. If you click that link and sign up, I get a free movie too, so it's a win-win. I'm a big fan, honestly. This is my fourth time that I've signed up, fulfilled my four-movie order, and then cancelled and signed up again to get that same thing. They're absolutely okay with it. They even suggested it to me on the phone. So... All you do, you have four movies for a dollar. You can order, I believe, one additional movie that will count towards your fulfillment. And then over the next, I believe it's two years, all you have to do is order four titles at the regular club price. And that's often cheaper than even what Amazon has their Disney movies at. April 27th brings another great Kino Lorber release. The Good, the Bad, and the Ugly. 162 minute theatrical cut has undergone over 30 hours of shot by shot color grading and a new 4K scan from the IB tech print as a secondary source for it. I can only imagine that this would be anything but ugly. So while April's a little slim on great new releases, the good thing is by, I don't know, the second week in April, I'll be releasing my March haul video. So I'll be having some great looks at some of the new sets that I've ordered from Hamilton Books, as well as obviously all the individual films that I've ordered as well. If you peek behind me right there, you can get a little peek at one of the sets that I'm talking about. I don't know if you can see that on camera or not. With that, I ask you, what video release are you looking most forward to this next month or even this year? As always, I'll leave links in the video description to the movies that I mentioned. I don't get anything for you guys clicking on these, just my way of making your search a little easier. Thank you for joining me. Please comment below and let me know what your thoughts are. Don't forget to like this video, then subscribe and follow if you'd like to see more videos like this.